I show speed is trending worldwide. The popular streamer is once again in the spotlight. Last month is because he had a severe sinus infection that made his eyeball look worse than Rocky in Rocky 4. He could have died, so all jokes aside, I'm glad he's okay. But he just made his comeback. This was his return from his severe sinus infection, and he was ready. He was primed and ready to cause some more shenanigans on stream because that's what he's known for. If you don't know who I Show Speed is, they are known for some of their popular clips that show virtually all sorts of crazy scenarios like lighting fireworks in his apartment to diving headfirst into his laptop, and they all become internet memes. This guy was literally the fastest rising channel in 2021, and yesterday on his comeback live stream, he accidentally exposed the private parts, which is why I show meat is also trending worldwide. I saw the I show meat hashtag trending and I was like oh my god I have to see what's going on and I saw the clip there is a clip that is on Twitter from his live stream where he gets up screaming I guess from playing Five Nights at Freddy's which is kind of a scary game and he was jump scared and he started like shaking his private around and his private his little speed popped out of his boxers and uh whew, a audience of about 24,000 people got a lot of meat in their face that night. And of course, just like me, I would have been embarrassed. I'm a grower, not a shower. All 8-inch Eric of me. But yeah, he immediately ended the stream and right then, Twitter blew up. People were talking about this situation like, holy crap, his wiener was exposed. And they're starting to speculate, is he going to get banned off of YouTube? I think he just reached 19 million subscribers, so that's a huge chunk of a channel to be deleted. Now, YouTube does have policies that do prohibit content that is exposed genitals and breast and buttocks and stuff that are meant for sexual gratification purposes. I don't know if this is going to be any kind of like bannable offense because it was an accident, but if I was him, I would at least go back and use the YouTube in-studio video editor to edit that segment out. You could see shortly when he realized it, he freaked out, ended the stream, but it was too late. Uh, people, of course, clipped it, and it's all over the internet, including on Drama Alert's Twitter channel, which I just picked up and looked at, and that's how I found this clip. Ooh, man, it happens to the best of us, ladies and gentlemen. I thought this whole DSP gaming thing where he accidentally left the camera on a few years back and was whacking it was embarrassing. This I show speed thing is pretty embarrassing too, but this also fits in with the brand. Again, like I mentioned, I show speed is known for doing all sorts of wild and wacky things on camera. <laughs> and he also previously lit fireworks in his apartment and he's he's quite a character and that's why he's very popular. But when you're this big of a internet personality and something like this happens where your private parts accidentally get exposed to over 20,000 people, you're not going to hear the end of it for quite some time. <laughs> and is this risk of a YouTube ban his fault? No, but you got to think of an account to where the the public that watches YouTube is all sorts of ages and stuff. And I've gotten hit with nudity strikes in the past for not even having nudity in a video. I did an April Fool's prank where it looked like it was a leaked sex tape. And I was suggestively um, rubbing my crotch, but there was no nudity. There was nothing real, like, I guess, rated X about it. But I still got a strike. Now, is he going to get banned who knows, maybe they'll favor a bigger channel, somebody that has bigger connections. But I would have at least deleted that stream the second that it was over, just so that the VOD would have been gone. But by then, again, like I said, the damage is done. Uh, people probably <laughs> have it saved and have mirrored it and re-uploaded it. I mean, the Drama Alert Twitter has it, and um, the reaction to this is actually quite funny, especially when you see the memes that are already coming out this is on brand again with the whole I Show Speed brand. You can see Keemstar. I Show Speed is trending with I Show Meat. And you can see uh, Kick is jumping on it. Hopefully he makes the right move. Kind of big, not going to lie. How do you recover from this? Uh, I'm going to put W on this poll. I mean, this is nuts. Literally, no pun intended. And you can see uh, people actually have it clipped again. The clip that I showed. It's pixelated, but you can see it's big enough. 
you could see that it is big enough for uh for, for it to be uh on camera there's no denying it that the the i show meet was going on honestly though any publicity is good publicity whether he showed his wiener or not and is getting kind of roasted because of it it's probably the best thing to happen to him he's trending again last month it was because he had that sinus infection this month is because he showed his ding dong accidentally what's next at this point who knows right good publicity is bad publicity and bad publicity is good publicity i've been known to show butt crack and stuff on camera when i accidentally twerk but i've yet to show my wiener i've tweeted it once and i immediately deleted it and not too many people have that file saved now you see people are even making fun of it with the Spider-Man. You can see, bro, it's a canon event in reference to stuff that is inevitable in the Spider-Man series having to happen. And you can see people are just posting it all over. Like, this is something that is absolutely trending worldwide. <laughs> oh, man. And people are saying they hope that YouTube will forgive them. Again, it wasn't like he purposely did it. Maybe, you know, he'll be able to... Uh, get away with it and maybe delete the vod and get a second chance from youtube itself i think if it's edited pixelated deleted of any sort he might be able to get it taken care of i'm sure he's in contact with somebody firsthand at youtube about this whole situation again he's quite a character and this is on brand so i find it to be hilarious and to be honest just to throw a little bit of speculation out there with content creators nowadays, especially like I Show Speed, a lot of times they cause situations and stuff like this because they know it's going to go viral and it gets them a little bit of attention. So maybe there's a small sliver that this might have actually been something that was planned and he was going to risk the ban because in the long run, he gets banned from YouTube or even Twitch. He gets a better deal on Kick, which just gave $100 million to XQC not even a couple months ago. So who knows when it comes to people like I Show Speed. What do you guys think? Let me down down below in the comments and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Thank you for watching. Wait, 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 wait. I want to announce something. I am now available for video request on Cameo. So if you need me to do a fun little video idea for you, like break up with your girlfriend, ask a girl out, maybe roast somebody that you don't like, hit me up on Cameo. My rates are cheap and I'm quick and easy, just like your mother. So yeah, link down below in the description, in the comments. Request a Cameo from me. Who are you going to spend it on? Some fucking celebrity that doesn't give a shit about you? Get 8BE.